しいかい悲しいかい結構結構どれよどれサボアミザブトサボアどれ Hello, I am Reverend Marvin Harada. I am presently serving as the bishop of our Buddhist Churches of America. This is an unprecedented year for all of us in the Buddhist Churches of America、uh, due to the、uh, coronavirus pandemic. All of our churches and temples have canceled their Obon festivals and their Obon Odori、uh, for this year. It's very sad for us to not be able to have our Obon festivals and our Obon Odori. Uh, this year, it's such a special time for all of us, not only our own members and we Buddhists, but the entire community、uh, at our churches and temples all come out to dance, to join in the celebration,、uh, and to really enjoy the festivities、uh, of Obon. It's a favorite event for myself as a minister. I get to see so many individuals that maybe I haven't seen in some time.、Uh, young people come home from college, or if they're、uh, living away from home,、uh, many come home、uh, for Obon to、uh, join in the、uh, festivities. And I get to see、uh, young people that have grown up at the temple that I haven't seen in some years. And it's just wonderful to see them. And to be with our entire Sangha and to see so many people in the community and from, from other churches and temples nearby that come to, to dance.、Uh, we dance in the joy and celebration of the Buddhist teachings, and we also、uh, dance in deep gratitude、uh, for the loved ones in our past that we remember at Obon time. This year, uh, especially, uh, there may be some individuals who lost a loved one, and we weren't even able to have a funeral service for that loved one because of the coronavirus.、Uh, we even lost a dear member of Orange County Buddhist Church、uh, due to the coronavirus.、Uh, maybe some of you、uh, have lost an acquaintance or, or a loved one、uh, during this past year. And you are also observing what we call as Hatsubon、uh, as we enter the Obon season. So, although this year、uh, will be sad and not being able to have our、uh, Obon festivals, how much more special will they be next year? And how much more so will we deeply cherish uh, the uh, event and be able to hold it、uh, again next year? So, we look forward to、uh, the coronavirus、uh, subsiding, where we can return to、uh, our previous schedules、uh, and our events and activities at our churches and temples throughout、uh, the BCA. Most of all, our Obon festivals and Obon Odori.、Uh, many temples are trying something very unique, and the BCA is also going to do a Virtual Obon, in which、uh, everyone、uh, throughout the BCA can dance in their own living room or in their own uh, home uh, along with uh, others uh, via Zoom. So we do the best that we can in the situation, and I hope that all of you are staying safe and healthy, and that、uh, as we observe Obon, think of our loved ones. May we have a profound gratitude for all the causes and conditions, conditions that have allowed us、uh, to have this precious thing that we call life. Thank you very much. Hello, everyone. My name is Reiko Iwanaga, also Hanayagi Reimichi, and I've been asked to present Obon no Uta as originally choreographed by Reverend Yoshio Iwanaga. And this is how we dance it at the San Jose Buddhist Church Betsuin 
There are other variations, and I'm here to present this original choreography. So please join me. It's all very simple. As you know, we dance uh, in a circle, and this will be counterclockwise. Circle, circle, and circle. Face inside the circle, cross, step, tap, step, tap, step, tap, circle, inside, cross, once more. Circle, circle, circle. And sometimes when we cross, some people exaggerate it, and that's wonderful too. Use your own interpretation and be enthusiastic. Because it is a simple dance, it does give us a chance to reflect and remember those we've loved and to extend our gratitude. So thank you very much. I hope you'll enjoy it. Thank you.
Hi, my name is Chris Lee and I am part of Utsuki Kai. We are a mochi pounding team from Portland, Oregon. Today, I'm going to teach you how to dance the Portland Mochitsuki Ondo. A quick thanks to Ryan Doran, the keyboardist from Happy Fun Smile, who composed this song for us. So, if you're familiar with pounding mochi, you'll know all the moves to this song already. It's very simple. The first move is to pound the mochi. So, pound, 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 pound. And then we're going to knead the mochi and go in a circle. So, knead, 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 knead. After that, we flip the mochi, flip the mochi, wipe our brow, wipe our brow. The next part, since we're utsuki kai, usagi, which is rabbit, it's rabbit, rabbit, bunny in the moon. So the last part, we'll do bunny ears, and then as you drop your hands around, the left one becomes the moon, the right one is the rabbit and the moon. So I'll do the, the moves one more time. So it's pound, 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 knead, 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 Flip, flip, wipe, wipe, bunny, bunny, rabbit in the moon. All right, so here we go. Yeah, yeah. 
Welcome everybody. My name is Nobuko Miyamoto. I'm artistic director of Great Leap and um, I'm going to lead you in a circle dance from the Fandango Bon Festival, a festival we do in Los Angeles where we share participatory arts traditions. And we're going to learn today a dance called Bambutsu no Tsunagari, which means 10,000 things all connected. Now, Fandango comes from Veracruz, Mexico, and Obon, of course, is from the Japanese tradition, uh, which, we, in, which we dance in a circle to remember our ancestors. So the first step is wakamaya. Wakamaya is a bird that comes from Veracruz. It's like a parrot that's disappearing because of the environmental crisis that we're in, okay? So it's step to the right, step to the left, step to the right, step to the left. Right, touch, left, touch, right, touch, left, touch. Very simple, that's it. Four, four figures, one, eight counts, all right? That's, that's the first section. All right, the second section, we're gonna come to the middle of the circle, starting with your right foot, okay? Step right, left, right, flip, back, two. Always with your right foot, right left right flip right left right that's the second section third section half moon with your arms starting with your right foot you're going counter clockwise and right step step touch left right left touch right left right touch left right left touch okay so fourth section fourth section you face the front I mean the middle of the circle and you're going to with your right foot fake lunge clap outward facing two claps step right two three four turn one again you're going to do it twice lunge right so think of this like you're, you're, you're centering yourself in the earth. So when you step, feel downward, okay? And one, two, and three, two claps. Step back, right foot, one, two, full circle. Connect it again, right and left, two claps. Back, two, three, four, circle, two, three, four, again. So start from the top, two, three, four. This is section one, six, seven. To the center, right, left, right, flip, back, two. Always starting with your right foot, right, two, three, flip, back, two, three. And right foot, half moon, two, three, you're going counterclockwise and three, two, three, four, two, three, touch. Then lunge right and one clap. Lunge left, two claps. Step right, back, three, four, turn, two, three, and right. And you're always moving. And back. Two, three, four, turn, two, three, four, one. What are you doing? For this, you plan, you lose. For this, you plan, you lose. Don't plan, just that. Right. Practice, forget. Thank you. 
Circle, dance. What you do? For this, you plan, you lose. For this, you plan, you lose. Don't plan, just dance. Practice, forget. For this.
What, you want more? Oh, yeah. 